This is the city of Solis. The city itself is, well, very beautiful. It's, it's a small Italian city by the Mediterranean. That's a certain glow now, doesn't it? But the story is all about deception. And the appearance of my city is no different. On the outside, it looks peaceful, but in reality, it is about the shadiest city in the world. If you are or have been familiar with the doings of the infamous Italian Mafia, then you can all accredit it to this one location. Their leaders and headquarters were once all located here. This is where the decisions were made. This is where they were carried out. This is Capo de Toto Capi, or the head of all heads. Leonardo the leader, my leader. That's right. I myself was once part of this powerful and corrupt group. My family, well, my family is complicated. You see, my father, George, is the old friend of Capo Leonardo. My brother, Edmund, himself, is also a deceptive maniac, in my opinion. We are only afraid of ourselves, though. Outsiders live in fear, but we are no different. We all have a secret fear for one man. Leonardo is the deceptive and manipulative genius. No remorse for human life, including his own family. His lifestyle killed his mo the mother of his daughters, and his daughters have always been his tools. He knows how to control people. Blackmail, bribery, threats, or just plain out beating you half to death with his bare fists. He isn't the kind of guy you want as an enemy. He was doing. Th he's been doing this for thirty years. He knows how to make people crack. Whispers had been going about concerning the age of Capo. He was nearing his sixties at that point, and no other leader had gone nearly as long as he did without being overthrown or killed first. I feel like, to an extent, Capo was aware of this. That's why he did what he did. That's where he found his mistake. And that is where our story begins. Come in, George. Hello, sir. Um, what have you been calling me here for? I have no idea what you said. You need to work on that English accent. I don't know what you're so trying to tell me, do. That's just offensive. Anyway. Um, I need to talk to you, old friend. <laughs> what is it that you need from me? Well, George, I've been noticing lately. There's been the whispering going on. Oh, you don't have to listen to the whispering, man. I don't know what you're trying to do here. The sound's Jamaican. I am sorry, sir. Either way, I've been noticing lately that the whispering has been going on. They're saying that I'm too old, that something bad is going to happen to me if I do not quit. You are not going to quit. Nobody going to quit until they die. Yeah, but you see, I don't want to do that. All of my uh, predecessors have been overthrown. Is I can pass down the torch now, and I don't have to worry about being overthrown. I will be the one. Ah. Ah, my three beautiful daughters. What do you have to say for yourselves? Are you going to discipline us? Please don't discipline us, Father. It was all Cory's fault. Hey guys, that's not nice. I didn't do anything. Yeah, it was all her. She was the one that did it. I did not poison his cup. What are you guys even talking about? Wait, what? What are you talking about? That's besides the point. Anyway, what were you going to say? Well, what I was trying to tell you before you rudely interrupted me with your stinking poison talk. Ugh, wrong Shakespeare play. I was going to tell you that I have decided to retire. What? Nobody e has ever retired from the Mafia. You know, it always retires you. Yeah, Father, you kind of, you know, have to die first. 
That is so scary coming from my own daughters. Anyway, I was going to give you, uh, I was going to give you a little bit of it. You know, I was going to split it between you. But, you know, yeah, you don't want it. What? I want it. How do I get it? Hold your horses. Hold your horses. I have a simple test. I just need one thing from you. I need you all to tell me how much you love me. Oh, that's easy. I love you. Let's see. You and all the friends and family in my life. You are my favorite. Mmm, that's all right. I would like to hear from Abby now. You did mediocre. I'm not Abby. I'm Reagan. I don't freaking care about you. Just tell me. I love you more than anything. <laughs> Ew, cheese and hate you. <laughs> Cordelia, you're the last one I need to tell me how much you love me. My favorite daughter, I hate the rest. Just tell me, favorite daughter. We're right, right here, here father. father. I don't stink and care. Cordelia, it's you. Um, well, let me see here. Father, I wasn't wanting to be in the mafia anymore. What are you talking about? Of course you do. You want to be a criminal like me when you grow up. Father, all we're doing is hurting people. Ugh! Get out of my sight. I don't want to see you again. I will not have a traitor or a starter who will go with the rest of the weaklings on the outside people. You mean the citizens of the city? Yeah, them. Yeah, you just get out of my sight. You are no longer my daughter anymore. Yes, not father. Yeah, just go out. So after Capo Leonardo retired, then he uh, he went to his friend George's house. But meanwhile, the person named Edmund, who was Edward's brother, my brother, dang it. Yeah, now he's uh, doing bad things because he's the bad guy. Ooh. Ugh. Hello, Abby. Hi. How you doing? I want you to kick out your father. Why? Your father does not need to be... Your father is a criminal. We're all criminals, so Edmund. You must understand that. But your father is a tyrant. It's time that we eliminate him from the picture. Why? This is all an experiment, don't you see? What do you mean? He's told me and my men before. All he wants you to do is he, all he he wants to take over. If you don't, if he doesn't like what you do, he's gonna just take it back. You're you're lying, really? Treachery. This is all just his own twisted experiment on what he's going to do. You know him. Do you really think he would give up? No, he wouldn't. So. It's, I say we just hunt him down now and get rid of the problem so you can have your, so you can have your, uh, mafia. You're right. All right, now, guys, go, go throw my father out into the rain. Good girl. Ah, look at me enjoying my little stay inside of this house. Ah, thanks, George. This is so nice of you. I know what I saw. I still have no idea what you're saying. Who are you guys? Hi there. You are my men, right? Um, go ahead and get me some more uh, of this hard stuff. Why are you guys looking at me like that? Sir, we have to. We are banishing you from this house. You can't banish me from this house. I am the capo. What are you going to do to me? Ah! You took me out into the driving rain. There's a storm out here. It's cold. And my old bones don't need this. Throw me back. I mean, just took me to the middle of the, the blooming mountains. I don't need you. I'll get on by myself. I don't need you. Just give me all you want, Storm. Just come at me. Just get me, Storm. Just get me. Ah! Uh, where am I?
am I? Uh, you are inside of, uh, the forest. Um, I have kind of nursed you back to health after you got struck by a lightning bolt. Uh, get me back to my little house, please. Those jerks threw me out. Yeah, um, Edmund made them, like, turn against you. And now they both killed each other over him. Oh, Edmund, that jerk. Wait, I mean, wait a second. Did you say kill themselves? Yeah, they basically had this entire plan. Yeah. Something that would have been really cool to, you know, play out inside of this video. But, you know, time, time-wise, can't do it. No time. Why is she here? Daughter, I banished you. Father, you were wrong. Look what they've done to you now. Can't you see how wrong you were? Father? You're right. I don't care. I'm angry now. I'll team up with you. I'm sorry. I mean, I really should be upset longer. But I'm not. Let's just go get back our mafia. Ah! Who is it? Who is it? Just come in. Ah, it's me, you little jerk. The person that you... That, that was the father of the daughters that you killed. I didn't kill them. They killed themselves over me. Oh, that makes it fine then. But still. Give me back my mafia. I want it back now. I was retiring. Now I want it back. Oh, yeah? Yeah, you know what I'm gonna do now? What are you gonna do, boy? What you gonna do? I'm gonna... I'm going to make you feel I've never felt anything in my entire life. Good luck with that. Shoot his daughter. What? Ah! No, not you, Cory. Cory, listen to me. I, Mr. Dad, I don't feel so good. No, you're going to be fine, Cory. Don't die on me. Don't die, Cory. Ah. You're the one thing that ever mattered to me. Put them away now. To the prison. I, I got, I escaped. But hurry, let's go, um, let's go fight him. And get your stuff back. I know what I have to do now. I know what has to be done. What, you're gonna fight him? Yeah. Give me 30 minutes. But I'm depressed now. He hurt my baby. He hurt my baby girl. I'm gonna hurt him. I'm gonna hurt him also. Alright. 30 minutes later. Alright, I'm here to face you now again. You bad person. Oh yeah? What you gonna do, old man, to me? I got a gun. I'm gonna shoot you. Ooh, that's a little violent. Do you think that you'll get age restricted? Oh yeah, this video's gonna get so demonetized. All right. Aha, uh -huh. uh -huh, you missed me, sucker. Ah, uh, no, you're gonna die. I'm gonna kill you. Ah, uh, fight scene. Uh I suppose that's the end of the great capo, isn't it? Hmm, a little bit of a disappointment, if you ask me. I expected you to be so much harder, so much smarter, but, you know, you weren't. Now you're just going to die. Ah. <coughs> oh, no, you're wrong. I don't know, it looks like you're dying to me. I might be dying, but you didn't anticipate that I put up a bunch of fuses inside of the basement. <laughs> what are you talking about? What do you mean? We're both going down, buddy. You're crazy! Capo, we have to get out of here. The place is burning down. Where's Edmund? Edmund, I think, got impaled by some glass inside the explosion. Oh, um, what are you doing? You're bleeding, sir. I'm a dead man anyway. Leave me. There's not much time. You have to get out of here. Why did you do this? I started the fire. I destroyed the mafia. Destroyed everything I loved, and it's all my fault. I did all of this. When I'm gone, there will be nobody left to rule the Mafia. Now go, soldier! 
Go live the rest of your life. Bye, sir. That I ain't to you. Please help me.